everybody? Wow. Now, if I had told you I'm going to preach another sermon tonight, I wouldn't get one-third of you out of here. <laughs> so good to see you all tonight. We're going to have a very special concert with Jim tonight and Karen singing. We're just delighted that you're here. So I want to just open our time by just giving glory to God and then letting Jim begin playing for us. Father, it's so good to be here tonight, and thank you for allowing us to, to join together and to just appreciate the beauty of music. Thank you for, for Jim and also for Karen, who'll be singing tonight. Thank you for both of them and, and just this wonderful gift they give to us tonight. Bless this time together, and may the name of Jesus be exalted here tonight. In his name we pray, amen. amen. Well, Jim, come on, let's go for it. Do I have it on? Ah, yes, it is on. You don't know how much I've been looking forward to tonight. I've been looking forward to this since, what, last spring, I think, you and I talked about it. And we had music going on in our household, Christmas music, in June, July, <laughs> August, September. So uh, I haven't gotten tired of it, and I don't know if my wife can say the same thing. <laughs> But anyway, I just want to thank you, everybody. It's so great to be here, uh, and thanks for coming out. Uh, the weather hasn't, always, hasn't been the greatest for coming out, um, but I'm glad you braved it to come out. And as the way I look at it is, this is just adds to the festivities. You know, it's supposed to look a little overcast and rainy and wet and gloomy, but that's this time of year, and I'm just grateful that we have the rain. So anyway... Um, I'm not sure how often I'm going to get up here and talk like this. You came to hear music. You didn't hear, hear, come here to hear me. So um, the, the next song that's kind of hyphenated to that song is, uh, I've got it right here, Winter Wonderland, yes. So we're going to play that, and then I think I'll probably just kind of go into Sleigh Ride, and, and then I'm going to uh, introduce a special friend here in just a minute.
Pastor Mike said something this morning about pulling out the stops. <laughs> so for those of you who don't know what stops are, they, those are these different colored stop tabs there along the console there. Basically, they just put on different voices and that type of thing. So anyway, just now you, a little trivia there. Thank you. Now I'd like to introduce a very good friend of mine who also is our music director here at Lincoln Hills. Uh, Karen, you've been a director here, what, three years now? And we have been so blessed with your direction, your leadership, and you've also uh, have been a good friend too. So come on up, Karen. We're going to, we're going to do a little medley. Going to start off with White Christmas. I'll be home for Christmas. What's that? Oh, I didn't do it. It's the beginning, did I? Oh, I'm glad. Okay. She said I should do white. All right. I should say, plug. I, it's the beginning. My tongue doesn't work very good. This print is actually too small. <laughs> it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Yes, that was meant. So thank you, Karen. <laughs> Thank you. 
So we got it out of order, didn't we? Now you feel better, Karen? Come on up. <laughs> okay. This is something that we had fun rehearsing, and I, I hope that everybody has fun listening to it. A little bit of nostalgia. <laughs> okay, keep us safe. Make sure we got the right song in there. <laughs> really? And the right key, too, right? That's right. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs>
Thank you, Karen. Okay, we did sleigh ride, we did, we, it's beginning to look a lot. So we're going to move on and do a little one called March of the Wooden Soldiers. If you've ever been to Disneyland and been over to Small Small World, when they play this song here, it may not be exactly the way you hear it, but this is the takeoff from that. March of the Wooden Soldiers. Thank you. 
Thank you. How many in here have heard of Mannheim Steamroller? That's a silly question. Everybody's heard of Mannheim Steamroller, yes. They were, and still our favorite group that I, when it comes to Christmas music, I just, I absolutely love the music that, they did, that they've done. So I'm going to do a few tonight, and starting out with a beautiful little carol called Still, Still, Still. And we're gonna try and make it sound a little bit like that with some of the arrangements that Mannheim Steamroller's done. And later in the program, I'll do some others that also have some of the Mannheim Steamroller flair to it. So anyway, this one is called Still, Still, Still. two songs are called Joseph, Dear Joseph, let's see if I got that right, 
Joseph, dear, oh, Joseph, mine. Um, another one that I heard on Mannheim. And along with that, we're going to do In the Bleak Midwinter together. And then, after that, you're going to participate. So get your, start clearing your vocal cords because you're going to participate. This is not just about me. Thank you. Now it's time for everybody to stretch your legs and, you, and your vocal cords. We're going to sing about three. And do we have the slides ready up there, uh, Randy or Pastor? Let's see. Pa oh, that's right, Pastor. So if it goes wrong, blame Pastor Mike. <laughs> anyway, we're going to do two verses, and then we're going to move over to O Come, Faithful. And we're going to do three verses that... 
uh, second, the, the second verse in O Come, after the second, listen to the modulation. I'm going to change keys and go up. So just listen to those little subtle things there, and you'll be just fine. So we're going to teach you all a carol here. Good job, good job. Karen, I think you've got some choir members to recruit. Are you going to go around and, and strong arm there? Okay, good. All right. This next one is one that was near and dear to me when I was growing up. And matter of fact, our choir is working on this very one. And um, so I couldn't let this go without playing it. So I would like to do Gesù Bambino, or otherwise known as the Baby Jesus.
Thank you. Now I told you I was going to do some Mannheim steamroller arrangements, so this next two are from that as well. Bring a torch and the holly and the ivy. Thank you. 
This next one may not be familiar to many of you. I found this on a, on a CD recording that was made many, many years ago. And I know, Karen, you might have heard it. You, you lived in, Link, in England for a while, so this might have been somewhere back there. But anyway, this is called the Silver, sl sl silver Sleigh Bells. It's got a catchy little tune here. Okay, looks like it's time for some participation. That's what I was going to say. That's right, yeah.
was a perfect lead-in for you, wasn't it? <laughs> Got to be serious now. Okay, we are getting toward the end of our program. This is going pretty quick, so no excuses here. This next one was, when I was growing up, my, my mom was also a church organist. I guess I didn't tell, or not everybody knows that. I grew up in a family of musicians, and my dad sang, my mom played the organ and the piano, so I got my first start with listening to her. But anyway, she was also a theater organ buff. Even though she didn't play theater organ, uh, she would have if she had the chance. So she grew up in Atlanta, Georgia, and not too far from the Fox Theater, which has a beautiful Moeller 42 rank pipe organ in it in the theater. And my mom was absolutely smitten with it. So she was a fan of George Wright. George Wright was a theater organist who kind of cut the mold for all of us who followed in his footsteps because when I was growing up, George Wright was the icon. He was the one that everybody strove to be like, to, to be like. Anyway, he did a piece in one of his records called Brazilian Sleigh Bells. And uh, that one is, I've always, I've known since I was little. So I thought, I'm, one of these days, I'm going to learn that thing. So anyway, here it is, Brazilian Sleigh Bells.
That's good exercise. Uh, guarantee you'll burn 200 calories. Okay, this one, let's see. This is some more Mannheim steamroller influence here. Christmas Lullaby. It's one of my favorites of, of the album they've done. And then we're going to actually do two arrangements of Away in the Manger. And so anyway, you'll listen and you'll see what arrangements I'm talking about.
Thank you. We're going to do kind of a medley of some songs and have yourself a Merry Christmas. Again, I just want to thank everybody for coming tonight. Um, this means a lot to me. I've been, like I said earlier, I've been looking forward to this for, for quite a while. And I just want to thank you again for being here. And uh, hi, Jim. How you doing? Are you guys leaving? Okay. Hey, thanks for coming by. Jim Martinez, he's going to be here in February. We're going to be doing the Valentine's thing. So come back, February 16th. What's that? Thank, thank you. All right, you guys, take care. Drive carefully, too, would you? Yeah. Anyway, yes, you'll have to come back February 16th. We're doing, um, we're, we'll be doing a Valentine's Love concert, and he'll be playing the piano. I'll be playing the organ. So mark your calendars now for that. So anyway, we're going to do just kind of a medley to kind of wrap things up. And last but not least, we're going to end it with the Hallelujah Chorus. So if you feel like singing, there's your chance.
worried about. We hope you've enjoyed this tonight. And if you've enjoyed and been enriched with Jim's playing, there are baskets out as you go out tonight. You might want to leave a love offering for him. We appreciate you so much, Jim, and thank you for just a magnificent evening. Let's close our time together in prayer. God, thank you so much for music and for the joy of the season. May we never lose sight of as we've ended tonight and hallelujah, hallelujah our God reigns. Thank you, Lord, for the joy we have is soul deep, and you've made it possible for us. Those angels announced that first night, joy to the world. The Savior is born. Let us leave tonight, Lord, with not just the joy in our heart, but Christ in our heart. And God's people said, amen. God bless you. What a wonderful.